Oh, it's raining. It's raining in our island. Testing, testing, test, test, test. Hello, every... Oh, dear. So, so sorry about that. The volume was a little loud there. Hello, everyone. Starting today, I'll be doing an island-wide broadcast full of island updates, going-ons and such. Hmm? Or goings-on and such. Hmm? I'll go over some of the things that are very important to island life, so lend me your island ears for a short time. Now, it's only fitting that we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. The Homeland Airport is now open for business. Starting today, you can use online or local communication to fly to other islands for a visit. That's not all. No, no. The airport counter now offers postal services. And just like the Resident Services Center, the airport is open 24 hours a day. So please do drop by for a look. That's all from me. I do hope you all enjoy another fine day of luxurious homeland living. Pretty good, huh? Pretty good way to start back our second day. All right, adventurers. Welcome to all play. As you can see, uh, I'm playing pretty late on the 21st. Um, I don't have an excuse. I mean, I work. <laughs> I work. So it, it, my schedule is pretty all over the place as far as uh when what time of day i'll be playing i know for the foreseeable future like there's only gonna be two days a week where i can play in the middle of the day but i can either play really early like maybe let's go eight nine ish or i can play really late after like 11 p.m so i'll be pushing it i will be pushing it for you guys because i miss doing videos and of course i won my first trip back uh my first round back for the channel to be Animal Crossing. Um, I was talking with my friend, and I'm actually interested in postal services. Because we have internet now, that means I don't have to pass something off to my friend for them to be able to uh, mail stuff. I'm actually really interested to get stuff from my friend. I got something from my mom. Aww. My dear Jewel, how is your new life treating you? Are you eating well? Brushing your teeth? Washing behind your ears? Oh dear, I'm all worked up. Here's a little something to help out. Eat it or plant it, but think of me. Mom. I like the mom letters. Let's take that. I already know. I have an idea of what it is. I don't know for sure what it will be. Um, that's all the mail from mom. Let's go ahead and open that right now. I forgot the controls for this game. I realized I didn't open the presents from yesterday. Uh, we got a Nintendo Switch as some furniture to drop in the house. The When it's a leaf like this, that means it's furniture. A simple DIY workbench. I guess I could put that in my house and I could just build stuff. Okay, dope. And then this is the present that we just got from mom today. Apples! So what I can do with fruit is plant them. And uh, over time, they will grow into trees. Um... Typically, oranges, which is the native fruit for homeland here, oranges will uh, only get me so much money. But foreign fruit, fruit from other uh, islands, I suppose, uh, will grant me more money. It's actually really hard for me to explain this game. I think I had this problem the first time around. It's hard for me to explain this game and talk at the same time. It's a lot of stuff that, like, if you're, if you're an Animal Crossing veteran... You already got it down. Not much. From what I've experienced so far, not much has changed. Yes! I caught a loach. It's looking at me with reproach. You know, I'm kind of glad they're not using the old jokes again. <laughs> I'm really glad they're not using the old jokes again. Okay, so I'm going to do some more weeds. I said I was going to do weeds in my spare time. Tonight I will do it in my spare time. I'm not as exhausted from work as I was in the past few days. So I will have actual spare time to do some cleaning up of the island. I was told that weeds... Oh, look at that, a present. I wish I had a slingshot. I was told that... Uh... Weeds actually sell pretty big. Ten, ten bells is, isn't a lot, but I guess that means there's a lot of weeds. Which I'm okay with. Which I'm okay with. Okay, let's go, let's, uh, let's put down, let's go to the house. After we talk to, uh, to Phoebe. Hey, Phoebe. Can you come here, please? 
Jewel, thanks a ton for earlier. I got my tent all up and running. Oh, all up and running. Thanks for that pep talk. The brochure said we'd be living on an uninhabited island, so I was all ready to go solo, Sparky. I could totally go for having rock stars like you around, though. Let me know if you need anything. Oh, yeah. I was thinking about how to thank you, and I came up with a recipe for a leaf umbrella. All right, so the first thing I thought when I got here was, now that's a lot of weeds. That's kind of where I got the idea. It's a DIY project that uses weeds. Think about it. Weeds are the most abundant natural resource we have. May as well use them, Sparky. Okay, so we're not going to sell these weeds. I had a feeling that a, a DIY project would involve um, weeds since they're so ample. I guess since we have the apple... I should plant some apple trees, but that would mean that I need a shovel. And I'm not entirely sure that I need to water them. I've always watered them myself. But, I mean, it's raining. And I don't honestly don't think you even need to water. Um, I don't think you need to water. What is it called? Water trees as they grow. But we'll find out. We will find out. That's our neighbor, Book, up there. All right, we're gonna head in the house. Let's head in the house. I feel like I have enough weeds to have a whole farm. <laughs> Let's head in the house, and we will drop our workbench, and then we can experiment with building uh, uh, tools. We can see what tools we can make. She already told us that we can. What was it? This one. We can drop. Whoops. Wait, is this a recipe for? Making a workbench, so I gotta take this. Yeah, I guess it is. I gotta take this to the other workbench, make it, and then drop it. Okay. I just said myself. <laughs> I just said myself that the leaves were, um, the leaves were furniture dropping the house. I am a, a big goof. Someone explain this fire to me. Someone explain this fire to me right now. Let's run in the cribbo. Let's drop by the cribbo real quick. Real, real quick. What y'all smiling at? What's wrong with y'all? Should I craft something using Tom Nook's workbench? Let's do it. Let's craft. Okay, so I can make a flimsy net. I can make a campfire. And I can make a flimsy fishing rod. So how do I add stuff? I don't know how to add stuff. But hang on, while we're here, let's make a flimsy net so I can do some bug catching too. Let's do it. All done for now. All right, let's see. What if I read? Oh, yeah, okay, so I have to learn it. Okay. Huh? Okay. Sweet. I learned a DIY recipe for a simple DIY workbench. All right. Um, so from there, let's see if we can craft a workbench. Yeah, but I'm going to need hardwood and iron nuggets. <laughs> I have no idea which one those, what those are. I'm going to assume hardwood is if I chop down a tree, it's going to drop wood. An iron nugget, I'm gonna assume if I attack um if I attack one of the rocks around town, listen, it'll make sense later. It'll make sense once I can get there, okay? Once I can do it. That'll make sense. But I think if I attack one of the the rocks around town, they'll drop iron nuggets. I'm guessing. I'm genuinely guessing. A campfire, we can make that. We have just enough tree branches for a campfire. Alright. Oh, t Timmy Tommy. Oh, this one's Timmy. Oh, welcome, Jewel. How can I help you today? I need to buy stuff, my my guy. Here's what we have to sell today. A whole campfire cookware and a whole toolbox. What? Is there something to the toolbox or is this just decoration? A toolbox would be 1,800 bells. I think I'm going to pass on this one. 
Not today. Not today. Ah, right, change your mind. Please let me know if there's anything else I can help with. All right, I think we're gonna we're gonna let that one go. We're gonna that one's not gonna fly. Not today. Okay, so oh, you got a you got a whole <laughs> you got a whole leaf umbrella too, huh? We'll get there later. We'll make an umbrella later. I don't think you can get, catch a cold in this game. Not from being in the rain, at least. I know you can get sick. There's medicines. I know there's medicine. I'm familiar. I guess there's not too much else for me to do within within uh this small little area of homeland. Not today. Maybe I'm missing out on stuff. Where are all my oranges? Where are my oranges at? I could have swore. I could have swore that uh all these trees were were busy bustling with um what was that? Was that a bug? These trees were bustling with with um, oranges the other day. What's shooting water? Mm. I know fishing is a little bit easier on. Um, oh, look at that! There's a snail on that rock. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna sneak up there, cause some bugs, some insects, we'll say, will disappear if you are moving too quickly. So let's see. Let's see if we can catch him. Got him. Yes! I caught a snail. It's not much to brag about. All right. I remember there were apples on, I'm sorry, oranges on every single one of these trees. What happened? Oh, look at that. It's shaking. Ah! Got him! <laughs> Yes! I caught a hermit crab. I think it wanted to be left alone. Because it's a hermit. That's cute. It's real cute. Message bottle. Let's take a look. What's in the what's in the message bottle? What's up, Mega Builder? Way to flex those finer muscles. There's a cool DIY recipe on the back for making the best muscle mirror you've ever seen. It makes it oh a muscle mirror cool it makes it a breeze to visualize your best and buff itself go try it out i got a diy recipe so for a wooden table mirror uh let's pick this up some coral now i remember them saying that coral sells coral sells for the big bucks baby let's do a little bit of fishing ah, ah i got him <laughs> Yes! I call it a sea butterfly. Try not to confuse it for a sea moth. <laughs> I wonder if... Oh, I, I'm going to assume, yeah, I got a pocket limit. What's in this shell? Dope. Do shells? Oh, yeah, they stack now. Thank God, see... Uh, uh, what's it called? Shells? Thank God they stack now. That was hell. <laughs> Dealing with that was hell. So check this out. There is a glowing spot every day. There's at least, oh, I'm sorry, there is exactly one glowing spot every single day. And what you want to do is get a shovel and dig it up. It's going to give you some money, I believe. Money buried there. What you can do, it's not money. I forget what's buried there. It might not be anything, but what you can do is bury money there and it will be a money tree that uh, pops up. It'll be gold and however much money you bury, or I'm sorry, bells, excuse me. However many bells you bury is how many bells will drop from the tree when you shake it. Well, times three. So it's a, it's a quick way to get rich, but you need to make sure it's in a proper spot. You don't want it too close to any body of water or rocks. Come on, catch this big fish. Catch it. It's a bass. It's a black bass. The most metal of all fish. <laughs> That's a black bass. <laughs> <laughs> I need a shovel. We, are we gonna are we gonna play this until we get a shovel today? Yo, where what happened to all my oranges? I know I didn't pull all the oranges off the trees. I know I didn't. 
Whoops. Wrong button. That's not the run button. That's going to be my entire playthrough. That is not the right button. Let's see. I feel like these fools in this in this island picked off all the app all the oranges when I wasn't looking. Let's catch this fish. It's easier to go fishing when it's raining. There's more fish. The, the, the appearances of fish are increased. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Yes. This is another loach. Yep. Another loach. Alright. Let's see. There's another snail up there. I want the player's guide for this game. I know that book is going to be huge. I know it's going to be gigantic. I want it. <laughs> I want the player's encyclopedia for Animal Crossing New Horizons. Come on, fish. Come on, fish. Come on, fish. Yes. Catch that fish. Another loach. The fish stack this time, correct? We, 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 oh no, we, they, we confirmed that they do not stack. Okay, fine by me. Fine by me. We're going to sell them anyways. We're just going to sell them. I'm not a fan of loaches. I'm not a fan of loaches, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry, I promise. All right, let's get to selling. Uh, I want to sell. So we're going to sell all of our loaches. Uh, I guess I could make space by reading these. Especially since I'm here already. Uh, you know what? Let's sell, let's sell our bitterling from yesterday. We'll be okay. The black bass has got to go. You know? Ooh, let's wait. I feel like these are going to be... Um, the, the coral, the clams. I feel like all the shells are going to be... Uh, materials that we can use to build stuff. So let's not sell that just yet. Let's hold off. Look at all the fine things you brought in today. Allow me to just run the. Uh, allow me just a moment to run the numbers. And done. I can buy these things from you for a total of thirty-seven hundred bells. Sound good? Let's do it. You know, let's do it. We can do that. Thank you. Please come again. Okay. So let's take the time to read. Up on these recipes. Uh, the leaf umbrella. Let's learn how to make that. Huh. Okay. Sweet. I learned a DIY recipe for a leaf umbrella. And then we still have one more. Uh, the wooden table mirror. Huh. Okay. Sweet. I learned a DIY recipe for a wooden table mirror. All right, so let's take a look at what we need to make those. Should I craft some using Tom Nook's workbench? Let's do it. Okay, so the leaf umbrella is craftable, but the wooden table mirror is not. It is not. It is okay. Uh, a clump of weeds. You just need 15 weeds. We got 86. Let's do it. Let's make a, a craft. I'm sorry. Let's craft a leaf umbrella. Yeah, yo! Made a leaf umbrella. All done for now. Alright, we still have this crushing debt to pay uh, for the wonderful Tom Nook. But we've got, what, like $9,000? Just a little under, I believe? I'm winging it. How do I see my monies? Oh, yeah. Well, actually, just above $9,000. Alright. Uh, let's see. Oh, we need our umbrella. It's raining. We must behave. It is raining. <laughs> Let's see. We haven't had anybody new move in, which is good. I am okay with this. It's just super interesting to me. Ah! Come here! Come here! There you go. 
It's super interesting to me. I want to see how many things I can catch with the fishing rod or with the net before it, before it decides that enough is enough. Because if it's flimsy, that sucker ain't going to last forever. Let's see if I can get anything out of these trees. Hey, a whole twig. Hey, another, well, tree branch. A whole tree branch. I'm waiting on something dangerous to pop up. You need extra branches. It's now confirmed. All you have to do is, uh... We shake some trees. They'll fall out. Hey! A hundred bells! I'm rich! <laughs> Yo! Furniture was in the tree! Uh oh. A table lamp. Let's see, my phone was just beeping. What? Oh, I got some Nook Miles. Uh, let's see where the new one is. Where would the new one be? What is a new one? look like hmm. oh shaky shakedown rumor has it that someone on this island likes to hide furniture and trees yes yes I'll give you nook miles based on the number of furniture items you shake out of trees so get out there and shake let's get those miles <laughs> 300 miles so he wanted us to hit 5,000. We're getting close. Oh, an active island resident. Uh, life on the island has lots of promise. Hmm? To illustrate this, I'll award you some Nick Miles based on the number of active days you spent here. Please take them and enjoy. Okay, so basically we want to come back in, what, three days? Or two days, rather. Two more days, I should say. Uh, successful fishing was one of them, right? Okay. I remember this. You want cons no, not that. Hang on, that's not the right one. That's not the one I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of the one that said, "What was it? Catch so many fish back to back without failing." Where's that one at? I didn't make that one up. I know I read that one. The hell is it? <laughs> Let me see. So was this it? No, this is just catch them in general. You got the bug. That's the same thing, but with bugs. I know I read this. <laughs> I know I read this one. Did I make it up? Did I play this in my sleep and I was pretending that was it? Without messing up. I know I read that. I know I read that. Whatever. We're going to go catch two more fish. <laughs> We're going to go catch two more fish, okay? That's today's goal. Get that one out the way. What are you doing over here? Oh, let me put this umbrella out so she doesn't think I hate her guts. I don't hate your guts, Miss Miss Phoebe. Everybody's playing the Animal Crossing today. I'm glad everyone is taking their time to to enjoy their time on the island. There's two. Three. So when I count like that, as far as I know, as far as I know for fishing, um, in the previous games, any fish that you catch will attack the bait or the, or the bobber, the hook, whatever, at the most five times. So once you get to four, if they don't take it, you know that the very next time they're gonna they're going to take it. Uh so I, I count to keep track. I learned that a long time ago. And ever since it has helped my fishing. Because once you get to four, you either know whether or not it's gonna be that one or the very next one. There ain't no more after that. Now that might be different in this game. Which I will commend them if like there's a setup that makes that a little bit different. Entirely possible that is different. There's one, two. Three. There's four. Hey, we got a bitterling. Whoa! My thing broke! The fish, the flimsy fishing rod broke. But I think that was the tin that we needed. 
Yeah, angling for, angling for perfection. Learning how to fish is an essential skill for living on a remote island. Hmm. Oh, I don't know why I'm reading it. I'm sorry. Let's get those miles. Yeah. 300. So we're at two, uh, we're at 2,600. We're just over halfway as far as the Nook miles go. Why is that still red? What else did I do? Oh, trash tools. Because my thing broke. <laughs> Using a tool until it breaks is proof of your hard work. In praise of your good deeds, you're getting Nook miles based on how many tools you've broken. Let's get those miles. Hey, 300 more. Is there anything else here? Is there any other one that I'm missing that, I, that I've obtained and haven't acknowledged? Jesus, I guess not. So we got our DIY recipes. We got custom designs and we have rescue service. I'm going to figure out what these two mean very soon. Well, I know what custom design means, but I'm going to figure out what rescue service means pretty darn soon. I want to see what that entails. Uh, I'm going to need to make another. I need to make another fishing rod. Let's make another fishing rod. We should have enough tree branches. Come on. There we go. Should I craft something using the workbench? Let's do it. Uh, we can craft that. Yeah! I, I don't think I can make anything else, right? I can make another this bounty to yet. We can make a campfire. I kind of don't want a campfire. I kind of don't want a campfire in my uh in my tent. That seems that sounds not entirely sure. That sounds a little dangerous though. Uh, let's get this umbrella. Where's my umbrella? There we go. And now we're gonna go back to the house real quick. I'm sorry. We're gonna go back to the tent real quick. Silliness. Actually, let's get this fish first. I think tonight what I'm going to do is we're going to do a little bit of beautification. I'll record it, but I don't think anything is going to happen, really. It's still early, and like late night stuff doesn't really happen real early. It's another loach. Oh, it's a dace. I hope I have some space. What's that? What's this one? What notification do we get this time? Cast master. Yes, this is the one I was thinking of. Why didn't I see it the first time? Cast your line carefully if you want to reel in this reward. You'll need to nab a bunch of fish in a row without a single one getting away to earn these miles. This is the one I was thinking of. I knew I was a crazy cast master. Let's get those miles. 300 more. We're almost at our 5,000. I want to see what happens when I hit 5,000. Now, of course, because we have Castmaster, I assume there's going to be one for um, insects and whatnot with the with the net. I always assume, I feel like it's safe to assume anything that we get for fishing is also possible to get one for uh, the, the bugs as well as uh, vice versa. Nook phone life. Gotten used to using your Nook phone? The fact that you're reading this probably means you have. Keep using it. Enjoy some Nook miles just for getting familiar with it. Let's get those miles. Uh, 300 more. So we're what? 1,500 away? We're 1,500 away from getting our 5,000 miles that we needed. I don't know what they were for. I have no idea. As I was saying, I'll probably do beautification tonight. I will probably... Uh, just clean up the clean up the town. Oh, sorry, the island. I'm gonna do that for a little bit. Is this this is Phoebe's tent? Yeah, yeah. Okay, just make it sure. Let's say who moved here already. Hey, what is that behind me? Oh, it's a snail. It's another snail. Okay. Definitely didn't realize that was a snail. Dead angle, though. Tonight, I'll do beautifications. I'm going to get this thought out this time, okay? I'll do beautification. I'll just clean up the uh, I'll clean up the good old island just a little bit. Get rid of a lot of the weeds and stuff. Since I can actually use weeds, I probably won't sell everything. But we're going to get rid of these weeds. Yeah! Here's a loach. 
It's looking at me with approach. Never gets old. It never gets old, ladies and gents. What is that? I wonder if it's something I can catch. Come on, fishy goodness. Come on. Yeah! -o! Now, one thing that I know for a fact. Oh, a horse mackerel. Of course, mackerel. <laughs> but I can't carry anything else. Should I swap it? Should I swap it? Yeah, we'll drop. Listen, we're not going to drop that girl's uh, umbrella. That would be mean. We're going to drop these stones, though. We'll drop the stones. We'll come back for them. It'll be okay. I doubt anybody's going to steal it. Um, one thing about fishing. My favorite thing about fishing. They don't stack, do they? Damn it. It's not going to be there. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to catch it. We'll drop the table lamp. We don't have a, we don't have a table for it. It'll be okay. One thing about fishing. Let's get this thought out. Um, for each of the five attempts at pulling the bobber down, um, you'll get, you're will get you more likely to get like the more common fish when it's one or two and the more rare fish on four or five. We're gonna drop that real quick. No one's. I I trust that no one's gonna steal my stuff before I sell this stuff. Let me in. Let me in. We'll sell this, and I think I think I can call it. If I'm gonna clean up the town tonight, I'll record it. It's just not gonna be super interesting. I'm I'm willing to bet. I'm willing to bet nothing super interesting is gonna happen. I'll record it. If it does, I'll post it. If not, it's okay. It's just it's just a a side adventure. Uh, let's sell the snail, uh, the snail, the, the fish. Let's sell the fish and the snails. How about that? Bitterling. Yeah, we'll sell that. Dace. Is that everything? Hermit crab. I think that's all of it. Where we at? Where we sitting at now, boss? Look at all the fine things you bought me. And done. I can buy these from you for a total of 4,840 bells. Sound good? Yeah, yo. We need to give, what, 4,500? Uh, four, I'm sorry, 4,000 in Tom Nook or something like that. Some, some dumb number. Oh, how could I forget, hmm? I should give you a brief explanation about that terminal. That is our Nook stop. It's a terminal for services that will further enhance your island life. And at the moment, you can use two services, Jewel. The first is Nook Shopping. It's a catalog shopping service for items that can be hard to find on an island. Second, this terminal serves as an automatic bell dispenser, or ABD, for the Bank of Nook. We're also working on the service by which you'll be able to redeem Nook Miles for various things. Please take advantage of these wonderful services. Quite beneficial indeed. Yes, yes. Okay, so I thought this was going to be how I paid Tom Nook back. Um, turns out that ain't the case. Once per day, accessing the Nook Stop will award you bonus daily miles. Day one is 50 bonus miles. There we go. Please select from the following services. Uh, Nook Shopping, ABD, or Sign Off. I, if I'm not mistaken, the ABD isn't just like, uh, my savings account. It's also how I can pay, uh, the debt. Let's see. Why is my loan balance zero bells? Interesting. Let's see. Deposit. Okay. So withdrawal. I don't have any savings. So how am I supposed to? Oh, I, I should probably talk to this man, shouldn't I? <laughs> I should probably talk to this man. Let's find out now. Let's find out now. Ah, Jewel, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Oh, the moving fees. Oh, you like to pay your moving fees. Well, you do owe 5,000 miles, so let's talk once you've had a chance to earn a few more miles, hmm? 
But there's no need to rush. No, no. Enjoy your island life and save up those miles. Okay, so I'm supposed to use the miles. I'm not supposed to pay this man off using my hard-earned bells. Understood. I, I like this system. I like the system of paying people back by just doing shit instead of... <laughs> Instead of paying them. Okay, if that's the case, then what we're gonna do, we're gonna catch this snail. My thing is probably gonna break. And then, we'll call it. I call it a snail. Nope, no break. Alright, we're gonna call it here. Uh, I feel like, you know, over 30 minutes, good place to stop. Especially on such a small section of our entire island. I mean, look at the map. There's a part that we still can't, there's, in fact, two, it's, it's section off. There's two parts we still can't even get to just yet, which is fine. It's fine, I don't want, ooh. I don't want the entire island to be within my access or under my realm uh, already at the start. I understand Animal Crossing is a game where not a lot happens, but let's not do this immediately. I caught a dace. All right. So we're going to call it here. We're going to go inside, take a nice little nap. Do I, I should probably drop some of this, huh? It'll be, it'll, my house will be arranged. Pr trust me. I will show you guys what the place looks like later. So let's go ahead and call it here. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button uh, below this video. That's that subscribe button. And... Turn on notifications. So I, it's been a while since I did this. Turn on notifications. That way you get notified whenever a video gets posted to the channel or whenever we do something special. Uh, there's going to be special stuff coming up. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Thank you guys for checking this out. And I'll catch you guys later with more here on Alt Play. I feel like ending every episode with me going in the house or in the tent for the time being would be perfect. See you guys in, see you guys in tomorrow's episode.